I want to commend the city of Birmingham for proactively making an effort to reduce crime, to slow down some of the crazy driving throughout the neighborhood and the streets of Eastlake, and to also cut down on prostitution. Anytime you have a municipality that's being proactive in doing what they're supposed to do and keeping the residents safe, uh, I definitely commend the efforts. To the people who actually live in this community, let's continue to be neighbors, let's continue to be neighborly, continue to look out for one another. Uh, continue to help one another. Let's bring the neighbor back to the neighborhood. So uh, when, when, when you think about honesty concerning safe streets, the message of safety is great, uh, but I have not heard any of the residents complain about what we're doing. Uh, it's just the way that it looks. Personally, I've heard some people say that if we could find another way to do the same thing that's just a little bit more beautified for the community. Uh, but the message is great and with every message you have to have a method to do it and so uh, We'll get the statistics back when there's a meeting here at the church But that gives us uh, the actual statistics and data of what this project and this effort has actually done I want to speak directly to the people that caused this to be an issue in the first place the people who are committing crimes uh, of course, this is zip code 35206 it's high crime, high poverty. When people don't have what they need, they take it by any means necessary. I've always believed that. And so those people who feel hopeless to the point to where you feel like you have to commit a crime, where you gotta kill somebody, where you can't snitch, you can't tell what's going on inside of these streets, I wanna tell you directly, I love you. I wanna tell you directly, beat me to the star. I got a tailor-made message with your name on it. I really believe that it can change your life. There is a better way of life. God wants you to have a better quality of life. It is the will of God for the people of God to prosper and you are in that number. And so I wanna meet you personally. I wanna meet you personally.